Hello viewers, how are you? Today I am going to explain you, to demonstrate you the experiment how to estimate the presence of particulate matter in different samples of the soil. For that purpose, we need these two separate samples, sample A and sample B, taken from different water sources, from different ponds. We have filter papers, we have funnels, beaker, we have this balance and we also have this heater. So first of all, I will take the weight of uh, filter papers. One filter paper is marked A, another filter paper is marked B. So I am going you to take the weight of these filter papers. This is our weighing balance. This is filter paper A. You can note it down its weight. It is 0 0.700 gram. I am removing this. Now filter paper B, its weight is 0 0.7430 gram. Now I will make the filtering cone of uh, these filter papers like this. It's very simple and uh, I will fit it in this uh, funnel and another A prepare its uh, cone. and uh, fit it in another funnel like this. This is our sample A. Sample A. We will separate it, mix it well and pour in this funnel having filter paper A. The water will drain out and particulate matter will remain on filter paper. We have to pour this entire quantity of water in this funnel. So I am keeping it for some time. Let it uh, settle. It will take time a little bit. like this. Now this is sample B and this sample B. Mix it well and uh, pour this sample B in this filter paper, B filter paper and step by step we have to add the entire water in this funnel having filter paper. So now this filtration is uh, completed and I have removed the filter paper from their respective funnels. This is filter paper B having soil sample, water sample B and this is filter paper A. So this filter paper A, now I am going to dry it on a heater. Take it carefully and put it on a heater to dry it. Be careful when you are drawing it. It should not burn. So provide it uh, heat in a proper way. This is 
filter paper A. We have to remove all the moisture from this filter paper. Only particulate matter should be present. You have to dry it. Paper should not burn. When you ensure okay, it is dried, still the soil is having some moisture. Now keep it here and take another filter paper having sample B on this and in the same way you have to make it dry in the same way. When I remove it from funnel it became, it is just torn, but there is no problem. You have to dry it, you can see that moisture is evaporating. This is B paper, you know its original weight, initial weight. You know the initial weight of both A as well as B. Now you have to take the final weight of these A and B. Just uh, switch off the heater and again take the weight. This is A. Now its weight, you can note it down, A, 4.440. From this weight, you have to minus its initial weight, A. Then B, it is 3.42, let it stable, 3.4. 420 420 is the average and you know its initial weight of B and you have to minus its initial weight. So from this uh, final weight you uh, minus the initial weight that will be the weight of particulate matter in that particular sample of soil. If you like this video then please do like it and subscribe it. Thank you very much.